in um, a sponge brush, Mod Podge, a jar, a fabric, and that's all you need. So let's you get take started. Your Mod Podge, just put a little bit on your sponge and put a thin coat all the way around your jar. And make sure it's all smooth. So now my jar is all covered and now I'm going to let it dry for 30 minutes. So see you in 30 so minutes. It's been waiting for 30 minutes and it's all frosty. That's cool. So now let's get started on the lid. So you take your fabric, you take your lid on top of your lid, you just put it right in the middle and then you put Mod Podge on top of your lid. When it's all covered, you flip it over right in the middle. And so let it dry. Drying, we are going to take our tea light. Um, you can switch it on and off. It's not a real candle. So you switch your tea light on. And then you put it right in the middle. How cool is that? Okay, it's all dry. So the next thing you're going to do is put it on top of your jar. Like that. And then I glued some ribbon right on the other part of your lid. So uh, it's been going to be easier to wrap. So then you take your lid and then just press it down. Well, just like that. And then you're going to tie a bow. You don't have to use a big jar. You can use a little jar. Like an old pickle jar or a salsa jar. And when you put the Mod Podge on, you could put um, sparkles on mine, like I did. So, thanks guys for watching. I hope I see you in my next video. And 